my lovelies, how are you? Band-Aid here. I hope that you are keeping well during this crazy, crazy time and that wherever you are, I'm sending you love. Today, I am gonna share with you five of my absolute favorite Irish companies that I'm gonna kind of go for a mix instead of just picking one theme so that I can show you the kind of wide spectrum of amazing products that are out there um, created by Irish people. Um, so let's go. First up, I have picked um, a company that I purchased my very first piece of art from maybe two or three years ago. Um, and I'm absolutely obsessed with it that I've like, I'm so obsessed with it that I've gone on to um, purchase this as a gift for so many friends and family because I just think it's such a nice thing to have in your house. So um, the company I'm talking about is Jando. It's a husband and wife duo and they do prints of landmarks, specifically Dublin, but they do other cities as well. But obviously for me, I wanted the Dublin prints. So anybody who knows me or follows me on Instagram will know that one of my favorite things or landmarks in Dublin is the Pillbeg Towers. And that is why my very first print by Jando is this so um i love like the color blocking of the like pink and blue i don't have anything like this it's honestly one of my favorite pieces of art in my room last year jando kindly offered to send me a piece of their art and they let me pick out something um and it was to do with one of their campaigns about dublin being home and being really special so i picked the grand canal and um, this is somewhere that i would have walked past every single day when life was normal <laughs> and uh, I had two offices kind of down that side of the city and um, all those years I don't know how many times I walked up and down there but it was such a nice commute and it really kind of added to my mornings and my evenings and um, so I went for this you can see it's kind of um, a similar, a little bit more toned down um, with just one colour but I, I just adore this so this is the um, the Grand Canal here in the back and then you've got your lovely kind of turquoise that says Dublin Town and then also let's not forget that they have a bit of Gwilga down in the bottom to, uh, to tell you the names of the places Os Gwilga so this is On Canal War we love a Tishel Ginnadoc. My next company comes all the way from the west of Ireland in a county called Sligo, which is one of my absolute favorite counties in this country. Um, and this is a skincare brand. So it's called Voya. Um, this is the best moisturizer I've ever used in my life. My skin, as a result of this moisturizer, is just like so much smoother and I just love it. So. All of the Voya products are actually made from seaweed, which obviously, as you guys know, has amazing properties for skin. When lockdown is lifted, I swear to you, one of the things I'm dying to do is to get down to Strand Hill in Sligo, where Voya is based, and have a seaweed bath. Like, put me in hot, steamy, salty bath. Now, wrap me up. Next up, I'm gonna show you guys one of my favorite clothing brands of all time not just in Ireland but of all time because I love the mission statement I love the positivity I love the colors I love the comfort I just love everything about it I love the community and that is if you haven't guessed already all things Fiona Lily so I actually was lucky enough to be one of the first people to try um, an all things Fiona Lily jumper she contacted me in December 2019 and kindly sent me out a Be Kind jumper, which I have worn to death. This is end of line stock, so it would have been going to landfill, which is obviously wasteful, but um, especially now with the work from home life, all I'm doing is living in sweatshirts and sweatpants. That's literally my day-to-day -day outfit. Do you know when you get something in your wardrobe and you're just like, what did I wear before this? That's how I feel about this jumper. So this is my second favorite jumper. It is purple and it says be positive, which is something that I try to do every single day. I try to stay as positive as possible, especially in such a tough time. Um, and this one says create your own sunshine. If you haven't checked out All Things Fiona Lily, please do. She's just an absolutely incredible businesswoman entrepreneur and of course a sustainable queen which we love next up is la 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 bog man beanie if you follow me on instagram 
it's a rare occasion that I don't put up a photo wearing one of these because, as you know, Ireland is cold so we need our noggins to be snug. And um, yeah, I have quite a few, so again, yellow, running theme. This is the very first one I ever got. Yellow on top, yellow on the rim, and then this kind of like green color. I love this hat so much. I actually didn't realize how valuable to your life it is to have like a good quality warm hat. These are handmade in the beautiful hills of Donegal. As well, I cannot mention Bogman Beanie without showing you they're incredible jumpers. I had this on me on Friday in work and our house gets quite cold during the day because as I said, like we're renters, it just doesn't have that like insulation of like your parents' house being like so warm and cozy. But um, it is this gorgeous jumper. So we have pink on the cuffs um, and on the neckline and it's kind of like this amazing like gray textured, fleck colour. It's one of my favourite pieces and like I just can't believe somebody sat down and made this themselves which I just love um, and it's just such a timeless piece. I'll have it forever. I'll probably even pass it down to if I'm lucky enough to have kids I'll pass it down to them and um, it's just a really really special piece to me and I just love it so much. Next up I just couldn't do this video without talking about a food or a drinks company and the other day I was in the kitchen and John was doing his lesson plans and I learned a very interesting fact that is coffee is the second most consumed drink in the entire world next to water. So I absolutely love coffee. I also know that the coffee industry is extremely corrupt, farmers are not paid fairly and there's an Irish company that is trying to break the mould here and that is Moyi. I just absolutely number one can we take a moment for this packaging like I love the pink. I'm just gonna read you some of the incredible facts about this company. So their beans are in the top 5% of beans in the world. It's 100% transparent and fair and um, the coffee has a greater economic and social impact which thus brings more job skills, income and profits into the country of origin. This coffee is created with half the CO2 of normal coffee. Um, it's forest grown, which promotes biodiversity to protect more trees, birds and their natural habitat. So you're really impacting the lives of the farmers, you're impacting the environment. And to say that this is one of the tastiest coffee roasts I have ever tasted is an understatement. Like it's so, Good. Like I honestly look forward to waking up every single morning and having a moi coffee. Like it's the small joys these days because we, we literally can't do anything else while we're in lockdown. And there you guys have it. They are just some of my favorite Irish companies. If you have any ones that you particularly love, don't forget to leave them in the comments. And as always, I would appreciate it so much if you would like, share and subscribe to my channel.